What if I told you that you can install anything on a flash drive, especially applications? Stick around. I'll show you how. Okay, before we get started, the only thing you're going to be needing is a flash drive. Depending on how much applications you're going to be putting on the flash drive is how big you want the flash drive to be. So once you get that flash drive, what we're going to do is we're going to format the flash drive. Right click and just select format here. We're going to select the file system to be NTFS instead of the FAT32. Then you're going to name the volume label, whatever you want. Click on quick format and start. Hit OK for the warning. And then after it's formatted, then we're going to go into the flash drive and we're going to create two folders. Okay, the first folder is going to be the program file folder for 64 bit. And then the other one is going to be the program file folder for the 32 bit. Okay, after that is done, we are going to download a software. In this example, I downloaded the 7-zip software. All right, so we're going to run the software. All right, here the destination folder is going to be the C drive, which we're going to change that to the flash drive program file folder, which because it's a 64-bit software, and install. Now let's open the program file. 7-zip folder and then run the software as you can see the software has opened and it works now let's do some cool things with it so what we can do is we can right click and send to the desktop now after we send it to the desktop we can actually open the software it actually opens so you can take this flash drive and plug it into another device and it'll open just fine. Now, what's going to happen is if you pull your flash drive out and try to open the shortcut on your desktop, it won't open because it's trying to see where the file is installed at, which is the flash drive. So let's test that. Okay, so we have our flash drive unplugged from the computer now let's try to open the shortcut it's saying that hey we can't see the drive where is it where is this software so let's hit okay now we're going to plug the flash drive back in and try to launch the software Okay, so now that we have the drive plugged back in, now let's try to launch the software. There we go. Software has launched. All right, so now I'm going to show you how to uninstall the software correctly, and there's two ways to do it. So the first way is to open the flash drive, go to the program file, and here you can uninstall using the uninstall.exe. The second way is to go into your add remove programs. So here it is on your computer. We'll see it in add remove programs because it's still writing to the registry on your computer let's so let's uninstall it here it's saying that oh we we see it we can uninstall it hit close let's close add new programs and there we go the the whole folder of 7-zip is gone if you find this useful be sure to subscribe to the channel and for more content like this be sure to turn your bell notification on and I'll see you guys in the next episode.